What's good, YouTube? Today we react to Jeremiah Cobb. He just committed. Ooh, <laughs> my God. That boy is stupid fat. Oh, my God. Did y'all see how he just... I want to run that back, though. I ain't even gonna lie. That speed was crazy right there. He doing it again. <laughs> he got control. He got control of his speed. Ooh, just made all them crash into each other. Oh, my God. Gave him the stiffy. Nah, he tough. Off two plays. He already one of them ones. Yeah, I like this. I'm liking it already. He already one of them players who I just love his play style. Off two runs. That's crazy to say. Because he can control his speed. Like, you can tell. Like, he able to slow down, do all that, change the direction. Look at him. <laughs> Bro, that is crazy, man. See, look at that. Look, like, look at the moves. Like, the simple moves. I like stuff like that. Like, he just doing simple stuff and hitting these boys up, man. And he, like I said, he can control his speed. Those are the dangerous players. Players who are super fast and they can control it. Some players can't control as fast as they is. Like, they ain't able to slow down when they want to like that. Ooh, made, made him just... <laughs> just made him look like he on a slipping slide. Nah, he tough, man. He tough. Him and Dylan Edwards, that would be a great versus, bro. Doing them two together, because they both got that similar style, bro, because they so fast. I got to see if he a track star, too, because Dylan Edwards was a track star. But this dude, like, he could be one, too. Like, he quick with his moves, man. I'm telling you, y'all shouldn't just know my style right now. Like, if the out of the running backs I named, they all run somewhat like this. Jaden Ott run like this. Emmanuel Henderson, he runs somewhat like this. The only one who I really like that probably don't run as similar as these guys is Nicholas Singletary. And if you see Nicholas Singletary highlights, you will know why I'm, I'm talking about that. Look at the ref getting in the way and stuff. <laughs> ooh, ooh, that would have been tough. Let me just run it back. That would have been, hold on. That would have been tough if he just stiff on this dude and just stopped. That would have been so tough. The ref really messed him off, though. Ref all in the way. And they got him on return. You know he's going to do something with it. Gave him a stiffy. Yeah, bro. He tough, man. He tough. He got, he got, he's he very skilled, too, bro. He got the full package. He probably ain't going to run nobody over, but he don't have to. He can do everything else. He can give you a stiffy. I don't know if he can hurdle, though. That's the thing I don't know he can do. But he gonna run, outrun most players. See, look at him. This dude couldn't even get up. He didn't even know what to do. <laughs> I gotta run it back again. Watch him right here. <laughs> oh my god, man. Hey, he gonna whoever get this dude, they fin, he finna turn them up, bro. And I'm seeing he might go to Auburn. I'm not mad at that, even though I'm don't want to face it as an Anum fan. But I I will watch that. I definitely will follow this dude, bro. Oh, so he can't. He is gonna run some over. I take that back. Now, if he heard of somebody in this video, I'm turning it off, bro, because that's crazy. <laughs> See, I, oh, he got, I ain't going to lie, he got wrapped at the end, didn't he? Or did he stay up? Hold on, I got to run that one back, bro. See, I'm, I'm a fan of little stuff, bro. Like, watch this. Just watch this. Watch how you do that. <laughs> you see how he hit a bit, bro, right, bro, right here with the little move? I like stuff like that, bro. It be simple, like, simple moves that you don't think that's, like, crazy. I like stuff like that because you can tell by just, like, the defender, the way the defender act. You can just tell, like, that's a tough move. He broke out of that. I'm telling you, man. He is one of the ones, bro. He's one of the ones, man. He's one of the, he, he's added to the collection of players for me, bro. Him, Dylan Edwards, <clears throat> they they on my list, bro. They on my list, man. I definitely watching him in college, bro. Definitely watching him in college. He out of Alabama. Okay, let me actually go look at his top six. I'm going to see which team I would want him to go to. So, he got Clemson, Auburn, Tennessee, Georgia, Texas, and LSU. Ooh-wee. That's a good that's a good top six though. I'm not mad at that. That's a that's a good top six. <clears throat> if I want to see him somewhere, the school I probably would say is probably is Auburn. I'm not gonna lie. Because I don't 
I don't know too much about Arbin right now. I'm not even gonna lie. Let me go look. They only got two commits right now, but the reason why I say Arbin is because out of the schools, I think the other ones already got players that probably get playing time unless he outplays them. So they probably gonna have more competition. So I probably if I want to see him play faster, cause which I want to do, bro. I like the way he plays. So I would say Arbin or even Tennessee because I feel like that's his quickest chances of starting because with Georgia they always getting good running backs like I think they got Branson Robinson last year and we know what he finna do <laughs> hey he finna go crazy and then Texas got a player like Trey Wisner in this class um he pretty good um LSU we know they used to get good running backs I don't know if they got one in this class maybe I should check that but I don't feel like checking it hold on I can check it real quick hold on LSU <clears throat> let's see let's see trey holly you see they got trey holly he, he pretty good even though this dude could end up like i don't know because it's been a minute since i watched trey holly so i can't really compare maybe i gotta go back and re-watch trey holly but i'm definitely a fan of this dude but like i said he probably got less competition going to um auburn or Auburn, um, Tennessee, so he can start early, which I want to see, bro. Like I said, I like his play style. So let me see. Ooh, look at the stats. See, as a sophomore, he run for two thousand yards, eighteen touchdowns. That's crazy. And he took even he he got less carries, more yards, and more touchdowns his junior year. So he was way more efficient than he was his sophomore year. So that just shows his progression. And then he even got better in the passing game. Actually, was a passing threat for real. So who knows what he's gonna do this year, man? Hey, this is definitely a player I'm gonna keep up with, man. But that's gonna be it for the video. Y'all let me know if y'all a fan of him now, cause I'm pretty sure none of y'all, a lot of y'all probably haven't heard of him, cause I haven't heard of him either. So, but I know him now, and I'm definitely gonna remember. Him. But that's gonna be it for the video, and I'm gonna catch y'all next time.